This is Atul from team K2 Academy and in this video I'm going to tell you what you can expect in the free class and I'm recording this video to create an invitation for a free class that I'm hosting everything about how to master Terraform and how to build this in-demand skill in order to land a high paying job. So in that in that free class, we will be, it's going to be roughly around two hours free class that we'll be doing a demo on where I'm going to bring an expert. He's going to show you how to use Visual Studio Code. You don't need to, but you can use um, any other thing, any other editor in order to create using Terraform to create and provision resources on AWS. We'll begin this whole training with what is Terraform, keeping beginners in mind. If you know, if you already know the Terraform overview, how do you quick recap on that and Terraform workflow? We'll cover things like the common use cases that a Terraform basically serves covering all the cloud, including cloud native things like Kubernetes, VMware now moving to cloud and Ansible and other things as well. So the complete use cases, including how they're being used in CI CD DevOps pipeline. We're also going to cover one of the common first thing you should be knowing why you should learn in terms of looking at job opportunities, both in AWS and as uh, AWS, both in terms of DevOps and cloud, including the job opportunities that you see what are available on the cloud, why you should be learning this, including uh, the job trends and the salaries, whether in US, UK, Middle East, um, India, will be covered, will be showing some high level overview about job, the salaries that you can earn. Then actually we're going to go onto the actual learning path that you should be learning things like providers, which are very important. The resources, building blocks, you should definitely know. And then we'll look at different modules to take you to the next level, what these modules mean, example of modules, and these are the building blocks of Terraform. We'll look at overview of those. Then we'll talk about things like variables, data sources, workspace, which is important if you're doing from a certification point of view. How do you manage multiple test dev, prod environments, configurations using work, workspace in Terraform. Now, state file is very, very important, whether you're doing for mainly for job in a multi-environment team, uh, where you have multiple teams sitting across globe. How do you maintain that state? What exactly state file means? Uh, important question in the certification. And then how do you import an existing uh, resource? So you already have built something on maybe cloud or on-premise. How do you bring that within the, uh, the uh, Terraform environment? The lifecycle blocks and then provisioners, not used that extensively these days, but then it's always good to know from a certification. And if you already have some, if you're going to support any old existing implementations, including Terraform Cloud from a certification point of view. This is the demo I was talking about. We'll go and demo. In fact, uh, if you leave me a comment, I'll give you some, uh, let me know uh, what exactly you want to know more about. Um, I'll be doing a guide. I'll share the guide on a guide as well as video on setting up a Visual Studio Code. So when you come to the demo, you already have things ready. Also create an account in AWS if you don't have already. And then this code that we are going to use, put it in the comment saying, saying that I want this code and my team will share that before the class itself as well. I'll also talk about 10 project work you should do in order to put in your CV as an experience. A lot of guys come and say, hey, I don't have any uh, experience in uh, how, do I, how do I clear the interviews. So the 10 projects you must be doing in order to get um, put them into CV, things like end-to-end -end implementation of building an environment, end-to-end -end environment on AWS. Similarly on Azure, at least pick two cloud. If you want to do Google Cloud or Oracle Cloud, do those as well, or pick one cloud at least minimum. Doing things like even setting up an event-driven architecture using Terraform. Configuring high availability in a multi-region and deployment model using Terraform setting up infrastructure monitoring in order to make sure that your environment are configured all done using Terraform. Doing a setup on network, advanced network, hub and spoke model, which is very common in actual implementations. Using Terraform in a CI CD environment, maybe with Azure CI CD or Jenkins or AWS and so on. Now, Kubernetes is quite hot in the market right now. And with so Kubernetes implementation with uh, a, with Terraform, things like EKS, how do you set up using a Terraform module, EKS module, or AKS module as a project work as well? How do you do an automated deployment CI CD using Azure? 
and I think you um, we've covered this in past as well in other some of other demos. But how do you do that demo as well? Once you know this, maybe uh, do the certification. What the certification means? How do you go for the certification? What are the options available and exam topics from certification? Again, if you want to know more about certification, we should have a separate video and blog. Leave a comment and say I want to know more about certification. My team will share that as well for you. We're also talking about the three hyping or three tasks or three things that, that you must be doing three step process on getting a high paid job one is learning this whole thing carefully and then doing the extensive hands-on lab as well as project work so that you can put your cv important things uh, your cv looks good then making sure that you prepare for the cv interview you prepare your cv uh, interview and we'll talk about that as well and that is how you will see results and we'll share some inspiring stories of what others did it in terms of how they cleared the certification, how they got up jobs, and lots and lots of uh, success stories so that you can follow their path, what they did it as, as well. So this is all overall we are going to look or cover. We'll begin with what is Terraform, why you must learn, common use cases, Terraform workflow, which is in it, plan, apply, the demo, concepts, eight week roadmap, 35 plus hands-on lab, 10 real-time projects, as well as the question answers as well. And oh, by the way, I totally forgot the free gift for those who, um, oh, we are going to cover the questions answers as well. And we pick, we get a lot of questions like, do I need to be a developer in order to learn Terraform? Or what is the difference between Terraform versus Ansible? Or I got this question in the interview, how should I answer them? So if you have any questions like that, let me know in the comments so we can answer, my team can answer, I can answer as well. Also, very interesting, this, this time we have done, there's a free gift for those all who stay till end. And I was thinking about free gift and two things came in, in my mind. I might do a top 10 interview questions, answers that you can expect in an interview or top 10 exam questions uh, related to the certification, um, cer sorry, um, uh, yeah, certification exam question, which one you want? Put me in a comment saying, I want interview questions as a gift, gift, interview question or gift, exam question and based on that we, we should be able to uh, this gift is for all those who come to the class and stay till end and maybe make this session interactive as well um, for those who don't know me my name is atul i have 23rd year in it um, last eight ten years i've been cloud multi-cloud devops kubernetes and so on as well these are some of the happy customers i have worked which um, and just to just to give the confidence that what you're going to learn is coming from real experience also i'm going to bring akhil who's an expert in this domain you learn when you when you hear from him he's going to teach a lot of value packed around two hour session with a lot of value you'll be able to do by end of this class you should be able to understand how do you do all this implement and learn all that again we get five excellent feedback i want to make sure that your time is well spent every minute you spend with me is is valuable uh, so at some point in time i'll ask you to rate the session and of course, five star for good karma, but if you don't think we deserve a five star, just let me know uh, what we could have done to make it five star so we improve for the next time as well. Uh, so making sure that you get a ton of value out of it. This is what you're going to learn. And with that, if you're interested, you can book a free seat by going to ktonacademy.com forward slash Terraform02. If you can't find the link or leave me a comment uh, and say interested or leave me what questions you have, my team will DM you. Uh, the URL as well. So how to master Terraform and how to build this in-demand scale session live with me and uh, with my team. And we're going to bring some experts as well. With that, this is Atul from Team Ketun Academy. Thanks for watching this. And let me know if you have any other question that you want me to cover. Until then, uh, bye for now. And uh, 